quite right. I just started my course on how to speak whale on Skillshare.com. You can really learn anything on there. Let's get started. My name is Willem and this is Kids News Break. If you are enjoying these videos, use your flipper to click that like button. If you want to dive into all the cool stuff we talk about, subscribe so you don't miss a thing. Because these flippers won't click the like button. The short answer to whether climate change is having an effect on whales is yes. The whale, much like the shark, is an animal that is on top of their food chain and doesn't have many natural predators. That means they eat fish and they eat a lot of them. When the water temperature changes, that can affect the amount of krill away. Oh look, krill. that smaller fish eat. Then there is less fish for whales to eat. A lack of food could spell big trouble for the survival of many whale species. Migrating whales would have to travel further to get their food source as species move with the change in water temperature. Also, the change in temperature could mean an increase in the number of diseases. Here's Nellie to tell you about how melting ice is affecting the whales too. Increased water temperatures is also melting the ice at the poles. Species of whales and fish that live in the colder waters, like the belugas and narwhals, narwhals, narwhals. the unicorn of whales, use the ice for shelter from bad weather, and other dangerous things in the area, like people. There is an increase in boat traffic and noise pollution that could really mess with the whales. Thanks, Nelly. Most of us have heard that the ocean levels are rising. You would think that will be at least good for the whales. Well, not really. The whales migrate to shallower waters to give birth and raise their children. If the water levels rise, there is less protection for them to do this safely. The obvious question now is, what can we do about it? I'm glad you asked. First off, keep your plastic waste out of the ocean. Secondly, support an organization that is doing something to save the whales. Organizations like the World Wildlife Fund or Greenpeace who work with governments and other groups to help change laws and protect the whales' migration paths. You could also donate to groups that take more direct action like Sea Shepherd. They definitely put their money where their mouth is before you give your hard-earned money to anyone though Always do your research. We want to close by saying this. We know that this is happening now and we have the opportunity to fix it. Let's do something about it instead of looking back and wishing we had a. Instead of just watching the news and saying, oh, that's too bad. It's our responsibility now. Don't forget to like and subscribe and let's show the world what a bunch of kids can 